Are you tired of your normal desktop? It's just boring, it's just a still image. But, yeah, you, you want an animated image, but wallpaper engine actually costs money? Or a free way to do it, alright? I did this for completely free, there's no virus in this, so... If you're interested... And, um... Is recorded after the whole process is done. So right now, I have nothing on even the program that's gonna be used here. It's not installed, so I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do it. Well, basically the entire thing. So I'm just gonna minimize OBS. Just open your browser, just search up lively wallpaper. And now uh, you there the top link. This will be in the description below. Um, in case you don't want to search for it, if you want to search for it, go ahead. But the link to this will be in the description, anyways. So yeah. Um, once you're here, just go to download and then press installer setup. When you press this, you will just put, get this. It's only 100 megabytes. It's not that much, but I'm not gonna install it because I already have it. But I haven't installed it on my computer, so. Now, uh, well, once you have it, all you have to do is just go to your downloads folder, and it should be right here. Lively setup times 86 full. All I have to do is just double click it and just press um, whichever you want. I'm just gonna press this for me only. Now it's just a language. Just use English unless you, you want other languages. And press OK. Just press I accept the agreement. Press next. Press next again. And press next again. Now you can either create a desktop shortcut or you can not do it. Or you can not do it. That okay. Now next you just want to press the next button again. Press install. Now we'll just wait for it to install. It it shouldn't take a long time. I'm just gonna close that. And um uh, I should also note that around this time you'll probably get another like another pop-up of you gonna have to install uh, Microsoft I, I don't know like, like a redistributable re, re, what redistributable what okay I I'm too dumb for this there will be another pop-up for you to install unless you already have it um, if you don't then just install it if you don't get the pop-up then just Leave it, okay? <laughs> now once you have it, just press launch and just press finish. Now wait for everything to launch and this will happen. But normally it doesn't tell you to launch, normally it tells you to restart your PC. But since I've already run it once, I don't have to do it anymore. So yeah, just restart your PC. That's all you have to do. And um, we can close the help button. And now there will be... Um, Instantly, a couple of uh, selection of wallpaper that you can find here. Yeah, there's um, other wallpapers, and there are also some customizable wallpaper. Which all you have to do is just press this button, and then you can get the intensity, speed, the brightness, and sorts, everything really. So yeah, it's 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 very it's it's very cool, and you can also have lightning, 30 fps look. You can turn it off, but if you want to use your own, per se, you, all you have to do is just go to type, and then you can either get a video or animated GIF. Now, that is, I actually don't like that. Now, there's two ways. You can either just get like a GIF, animated GIF, or you can get a video. Now, there, I, 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 I don't find it easy to find GIF. I, I for some reason, I don't know why. I, I just don't. So I, I just find a video. Personally, for me, the easiest way is just go to, um, just go to YouTube.com. So, um, yeah, I, already, I obviously already downloaded mine. All right, so I got things properly set up now. 
So you know, j j just, just, just load it. <laughs> yeah, just load it. You, you don't need the title. You can put the title. It's not gonna matter, really. I promise you, it doesn't matter. Just press OK. Now keep this window in focus, meaning like it shouldn't really like press other other things while this is processing. Now once it's done, you you can just uh yeah just press your start button or whatever. And it should work. I don't know if you can hear it, but I'm pretty sure you should be able to hear it. Yeah. The music. You can change this in the settings of this. Where you can just change the... Whether you want it to output um, audio or not. Now there is... A, a, the, the one of the only well, unfortunate thing about this I can see is that um, the audio out there is no like there is no like volume setting so you can change it out up and down you can you need to do that with the actual video itself uh, that's why I re-rendered it because it was too loud when I got it you can also get the wallpaper playback, um, so there will be like nothing and pause. Like, so like if other f uh, uh, application is focused like this per se, as you can see the, the the audio turns off, but the this is still going. So if I want to like make it pause, you know, to save some power maybe, just press pause and then once you go to another, as you can see the background is paused. Yeah, so that's what I did with the application full screen cuz like if, if it's focused then it, it's completely fine But it but when it's on like full screen, then I don't want it to Also turn this off just so like cuz um apparently it doesn't um, <laughs> It doesn't see uh, Sony Vegas as a uh, well full screen and it just keeps playing songs when I'm editing video and that's not what I would like, so yeah. You can use whatever video you want honestly. Uh, so So if you if you wanna disable it, if as you can see I already like closed the app but it's still going. So all you have to do is just you can either just go to task manager and um Go down here to live late WPF and just end task. Or you can go to this here, right click on this and just press exit. So yeah. Well so if if you enjoy the video, press like it, it every like helps me more than you think. And um, if you wanna see more of my videos you can press the subscribe button, that will also help me. And you can press the notification button to stay up to date with my latest video. I don't upload a lot, so it's not gonna spam your notifications. Just in case, if that's what you're worried about, probably not. If you, uh, never mind. Uh, 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 I, I can't do this. Why?